Now let's listen to a male vocal recording. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. Now I think the problem with this male vocal recording is much more severe than the female one. It's hard to identify a specific frequency band that is lacking or like too prominent. But I feel like bad resonances just populate in the entire low and mid frequencies, and they are changing on every note. No matter what, let's try suppressing it first. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. This is actually not bad. Many resonances are indeed suppressed, but overall, it feels kind of overprocessed, and the suppression is not even. So we can adjust the ratio and the knee. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. Yep, this is much more pleasant. However, there's still one more problem. This vocalist has a very prominent nasal sound, like mm mm mm. To deal with that, let's first locate the nasal frequency. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. Yes, right here. So let's try pulling up the priority curve here and see what happens. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. Hmm, pretty good already. However, we can hear there are still some transient nasal sound that have escaped processing because of our high attack setting. Well, we can try lowering down the attack, but that comes with a cost. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. The good news is. Those nasal sounds have been completely suppressed, indeed. However, the bad news, since we have closed the attack to zero, those transients now feel very rigid. In this situation, we can restore the attack to where it was, and then enable look ahead. This feature is exactly like the look ahead on compressors. We can set it to say around 25 milliseconds. This allowed Specraft to start suppressing the nasal sound even before they have occurred. Let's listen. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. As you can hear, all the nasal sound have been suppressed without hurting the transient quality. Similarly, we can also enable profiling and select from the presets. Let's do warm male vocal. See what happens. Mm, this time we can try turning up the depth. Let's hear what it does to our sound. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. Hmm, pretty good. Now I want to turn up the adaptive threshold, and let's give it a before and after comparison. Bypassed. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. Engaged. I'm not romantic, but I'm learning. All the frequencies across the spectrum now feel controlled. 